I like stuff, you like stuff, we all like stuff. What's up everybody? I got a new thing to talk about. It's actually one of my favorites right now. Um, You know, okay, so I've came across a couple different people on the internet, uh, Centennials. Uh, two different people. I can't remember their names. One is an Asian gentleman. He's 116 years old, I believe. Um, another is a black gentleman who was 106 or 108. And they are alive and kicking. And both of them had mentioned that they uh, apply something to their feet. And of all the different holistic remedies that I've uh read about and also have personally experimented on myself, I have yet to really explore this in great detail. I've, uh, I'm a huge fan of uh, Chinese massage. Um, I, I used to get them all the time. I, I should start going back and, and getting them more frequently, but they definitely do relax you. Um, and they also, I don't know if you've kind of been walking by on the street a lot of times they have the reflexology foot chart outside and how like the the heel is related to this organ and then the the ball of the foot is related to like the liver or that's not right but you get the point like somehow the bottom of your feet according to chinese uh holistic medicine is somehow related to a different parts of your body and i i think that's fascinating. I think for the longest time, I thought it was a bunch of nonsense. Um, but <laughs> here we go. You know, the proof is in the pudding. You have these old gentlemen saying that part of the secret to their longevity and health is by putting things on the bottom of their feet. So I'm always skeptical, but I'm always the kind of person who wants to try it for myself before I rule it out completely. So shame on the people that are just like, this is nonsense and haven't even tried it out okay but uh you know i i'm putting it to the test and i've been trying it for about a week now and i'm blown away okay so i want to make this video to kind of share my thoughts and what i've experienced so far and i think it is really amazing stuff um first of all uh, i i purchased this on amazon and i definitely did my research to make sure that i got the the most uh the the one that was uh, reviewed the best um this particular box costs twenty dollars and it contains 20 20 foot pads okay so that's 10 packs which means it's 10 nights 10 nights of stuff for 20 bucks okay so uh do the math that's not uh uh not expensive at all um here is the back uh, and the ingredients is bamboo vinegar chitlin. Okay, I can't say some of these. Vitamin C, plant fiber, negative ion powder. Interesting, okay. Um, and it's it's a simple process. The black gentleman said that he applied uh, olive oil to the bottom of his feet. So I was doing that for a, a, a little bit a couple months ago. And I just kind of put a towel in my bed and I would put the olive oil on my feet and wrap my feet up in the towel and to make sure that it didn't get on the covers and whatnot. And after about a couple of days of doing that, my feet got really soft. So that was kind of cool. And then I discovered these pads. Um, and, you know, don't mix both of these methods together, one or the other. But these are really cool. So those were the ingredients on the back. And um, here, let me just take out a, a pad so that so that you know what it looks like here. Um, here they are, there's 10 of these suckers inside here. And when you open up the plastic, you'll see that there's two, one for each foot. Okay, um, here it is in relation to my hand. Uh, pretty nice size. I will say that the stickiness on the side is awesome it really really works okay it's uh it's easy to peel off in the morning but it also definitely sticks very nicely to the foot and you want to make sure that it's as snug as possible you definitely want this part this is the active part right here to be touching the skin you want it to have contact with the skin so it's really important 
that uh, it's stuck or adhered to the bottom of your foot uh, as tightly, as closely as possible. Um, so that's basically, that's, that's what the front looks like. Obviously that sticky part is what you apply to the bottom of your feet. Uh, I've, a tr I've tried to apply it with my foot long ways and I've tried to apply it with my foot like this. Um, I don't really have a preference as of right now as to which I think is better. Uh, as you can see in the picture, it looks like they want you to do it long ways, but I've been experimenting with it um, the other way as well. I've also experimented with putting it more at the top of my foot and I've also experimented with it putting more to the bottom of my foot. So you can... Uh, experiment at home. Uh, I don't really have any uh, conclusion uh, as of yet, except for if you put it in the center, you might not have contact all the way. One of the nights, and I'm about to show you uh, what it looks like when the pad is complete, but one of the nights, uh, it, I guess it appeared that the, the contact with my foot was not as uh, close as it should have been, and in the center, it was completely white. Okay, so I've been experimenting, you know, with different parts of the feet to make sure that the, this part, the active ingredient side, is actually touching the skin. Um, so it's time to go to bed. You're in bed and you peel these off and you stick them on your feet. Okay, uh, so what happens? I will say the benefits immediately that I felt uh, once I kind of got snuggled in and closed my eyes and got comfortable, I realized that the bottom of my feet were tingling, okay? Uh, it's a very gentle, nice sensation, like, ooh, what is this? It's actually working, it's actually doing something. Um, and then I felt really, really peaceful and really calm. It's difficult to describe. It's almost like, it's almost like drinking like a, a, a warm, like a cup of hot cocoa it like it just calms you out it chills you out but it's you know what it's no that a better thing to say it's like taking melatonin it re, i'm seriously it really relaxes your body okay you put these out on the bottom of your feet and you're going to sleep better now you might not be used to having this stuck to the bottom of your feet which might make you at first not sleep as well. But once you get used to having the, the tape and the stuff on your feet, whatever is inside here, the active ingredients that I just read on the box, it does affect your body and it makes you more relaxed. Also want to mention that when you put these on your feet, you should also wear socks. That recommends that you wear socks. I also felt different sensations in various places of my body, specifically my balls. Interesting. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, my balls felt tingling by having these on my feet. Don't ask me how. I don't understand it, but that's just what happened. I'm just, I'm just the messenger, okay? So uh, it's making things happen in the body, okay? Uh, maybe it's balancing hormones. I'm not really sure. Um, but I definitely feel like I have more vitality and vigor, if you know what I mean. Um, in the morning, when you wake up, they're not going to look nice and pretty like this. They're going to look a little bit disgusting. Um, they're actually going to look like this. Ooh, it's gross, man. What is, what, what is that? Okay, look, let's just use uh, common sense. If this was inside your body and now it's out, that's probably for the better, right? Um, I mean, that's that's pretty gross. Um, and they're they're hard now. You can't really bend them. These, these new ones, see, it bends. It bends. It's bendable like this. This one, no, nah, you can't. It's gonna it's gonna crack. So something something's going on, guys. It's it's not. Uh, this is not made up stuff. If you read the reviews, a lot of people are like, yeah, it's a placebo. Um, you know, uh, I, it's not a placebo. Something is really going on here. Okay. Uh, I don't really understand it well enough to explain the scientifics of it, but this is what it is. Uh, I got curious and I, one night I actually put water before I applied it onto my feet. I put water on the the pad right here just 
because I kind of wanted to see. I was like, you know, is this is this the dirtiness from my feet or is this the toxins from inside my body coming out onto the pad or is this something inside the pad that's turning brown by itself? And it turns out that when you put water on here, actually, you know what? I'm going to do it. Oh, I don't want to waste it. I'll just do a little bit. When you put the water, it actually, it does turn brown. But, but, okay, um, sweat, the sweat from your feet and the water from the pad, okay, it, it's doing something. Look, I really don't know. I really don't know what's going on here. All I can say is that um, when it's wet, whether it's water from your feet, which is, I guess, why they recommend you wear socks so that your feet are more inclined to sweat, or actually, if you put water on it first and then put these on your feet, this is just going to get the substance more close to your skin. It's just going to get more into your body. It's probably going to be a little bit more effective actually by putting the water on it already because there's more contact, kind of like an electrical current, okay? So I know people watching this video are going to be like, oh yeah, it's all dirty uh, and you just put the water on it. So now it, you know, that's the reason why People think that, you know, it's not the toxins from coming out of your body. It's just, it's a scam. The to you know, it's dirty inside the thing already. You, look, you can think what you want. I know that when I put these on the bottom of my feet, um, it's it's having an amazing effect on my body. Okay, so that's that's all I will say. And, you know, it, it does look a little bit gross. I think it's just a misconception. These are not toxins from inside your body. It, that's just the, the change. That's just the chemical reaction from the, uh, the substances. Uh, and when they touch the skin, when they should happen to touch the skin, there are some effects. Okay, and they're very positive. So guys, I guess that's all I really wanted to say um, about this. You know, there's other brands. Do your research. Uh, you know, feel free to experiment. Uh, leave comments below. Let me know if, if you've tried these or not or what your experience is. I think it's all really great stuff. And, um, you know, stress is a big killer. If, if you can make yourself feel more calm and relaxed, that in itself, that alone is going to uh, improve your health. You know, I think a lot of people are waiting for like the big, major, incredible thing. Like what is the magic bullet that's going to make your life better? What's the, well, the one major thing that's going to make your life incredibly healthy and vibrant and make you live to be over 100 years old? You know what? I don't think there is one major thing. I think it's a lot of little things that you do consistently over time, okay? And even though it doesn't seem like this is, uh, you know, making a big difference, I mean, for me personally, I feel that it is making a big difference. But some people might not feel that way. But look, I'm just saying that as long as you do it consistently, it's these little incremental things that add up. And then before you know it, you're like, wow, I'm over 100 years old. And I think there's something to it. So... I just wanted to share it with uh, the world, really. Uh, I don't know how much information is uh, on about this stuff, but I just kind of wanted to show it. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, give this video a like if you found it enjoyable. Share it with your friends. Come back soon and watch my other videos. I talk about a lot of stuff. You're inside the stuff zone. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.